Here's what happened at this week's City Council meeting. After public comment, City Council heard an oil and gas monthly update, followed by the first in a series of preliminary sessions on the City's 2024 budget. During notice council business, council discussed three different matters. The council set direction for the city to host a workshop for community members and other stakeholders to discuss the issue of Metro districts on Saturday, August 26, and bring the topic to the August 28th study session. They then reactivated the membership of an adult member of the Youth Commission and finally instructed staff to create a regulation banning the sale of puppies and kittens in pet stores within the city to bring to an upcoming study session. All three items passed 7-0 to zero with two excused absences. The consent agenda followed with 10 items, all of which passed in one unanimous vote. After that, Council moved on to a joint public hearing on final subdivision plats for Reunion Ridge filings number 2 and 3, located south of East 104th Avenue between Peoria Parkway and Tucson Street. After discussion, both resolutions passed by matching 4-3 to three votes. The next public hearing involved an ordinance amending the zoning of the property of 8705 Rosemary Street from Light Intensity Industrial and Agriculture to I-2 Medium Intensity Industrial. The ordinance passed unanimously. Another rezoning discussion followed, which proposed to amend the zoning of the property at 7160 Eudora Drive from Medium Intensity Industrial to I-1 Light Intensity Industrial. This rezoning also passed 7-0. Next up were ordinances on first reading, with three ordinances passing unanimously. The first two amended the 2023 budget to recognize Adams County Open Space Grant funding for a single rider golf cart for Buffalo Run Golf Course and $260,000 for open space restoration efforts. The final ordinance amended city regulations for medical and recreational marijuana businesses. Finally, council moved on to administrative council business, unanimously appointing Mayor Pro Tem Jennifer Allen Thomas as a city council's second member of the Commerce City Rotary Club and approving a $2,500 expenditure to sponsor the Community Uplift Partnership Gala on September 9th. For more information about what happened at this week's city council meeting, we are online at the address on your screen. You can also watch the meeting in its entirety at c3gov.com slash video. Thanks for watching.